So I thought I'd show you my poor man's carving clamp before I put it to use here. But uh, this is a inch and a quarter uh, galvanized metal uh, plumbing fitting and a six inch nipple, four inch diameter uh, flange. Got that bolted down. I only had two screws, so I put two uh, eye bolts in front. It works. And then this is all threaded down in there. <coughs> and then there's a, uh, what do they call these plugs, Dad? Anyway, there's a plug. It screwed into that end, and I drilled a hole through it right there for a half inch eye bolt to go in from the other side. Now, on the T, I drill, uh, took the grinder and ground a bunch of little V's all the way around it. And they're pretty much lined up across from each other. And what that does is let me put this is my. Uh, this is a, uh, actually it's an arbor out of an old, old lathe. I made, I made a lathe, and this was the arbor out of it years ago. Um, and then this is a little nut with flange welded onto it. But that drops down into there. And then, turn this back around. That goes on there, and you can tighten him up. And your carving goes right up on top of it. Like so. So once this is screwed down on here, then I can loosen that nut and move it around up and down this way, and uh, can pivot it around in circles. If I absolutely have to, I can turn this, but I don't see much need of that. If I can turn that, I don't need to turn that. So it's a cost me about 20 bucks to make it, but I already had the uh, one-inch arbor in the. This, you can use any one inch ATPI faceplate on it, so uh, this one just happens to be one that we made for Dad's old lathe, and uh, it doesn't get used a whole lot, so it's, I think it's four inches in diameter. Well, yeah, it's the same width as this block, so. Um, you can do this with a three-quarter ID um, inside diameter uh, galvanized nipple with a flange on that, a, pl a plumbing flange on it and then screw that to your, I mean, it works the same way. Uh, you won't be able to put uh, one inch ATPI heads on it, but you can grab as many of the flanges as you have carvings and have one on each carving. So that's no big deal if you have more than one going. So thought I'd show you that before we get to, into the next stage. I just made this thing like a week ago. I haven't actually got to use it yet, but we'll see how it works out, right? All right, off we go.